not confirm, but if so, this sheds so much light on the Wagner coup. Today, it was reported that Yevgeny Prigozhin was killed in a plane crash. He was on the list of passengers on this plane. I believe this plane, according to the reports we are getting, was owned by himself. And according to some people, it was shot down by Russian air defense. Now, I made videos previously. Unfortunately, they're not um, on my channel publicly because YouTube did strike me. Uh, because they said uh, I was basically talking about the mutiny didn't really make sense to me however I had to take them down or else I could have had my channel banned so they're not on but basically I was addressing people saying the Wagner coup was fake and I was saying no it was not fake it was real so basically and I have a video that is a uh, public that talks about the ch possibility of a second Wagner coup happening and what I said on the video, according to this one Russian said this, if Prigozhin's either not dead in six months, or there's a, he's either going to be dead in six months, or there's going to be another coup, okay? So, if this is true, Prigozhin is officially dead. If this, again, is true, he was listed on the uh, passengers on the plane. However, as we've seen with the past few months with Russia, it can be very confusing to even know what's going on in Russia so we don't know if this is true again this video is based off if it's true uh, first off disclaimer YouTube I do not condone any assassinations of anybody any illegal killings or nothing like that I am not promoting that I am just reporting on the news because I am a news channel so yeah now since we have that out of the way what does this mean for the coup so for all those people saying the coup was fake this probably means Actually, it wasn't, and it was real. And Putin waited to get his revenge. Because if Prigozhin was, is seriously dead and was shot down over Moscow, I mean over Russia, by Russian air defense, according to many, uh, that was that was obviously that was obviously the Russian government. Okay, so that probably means the coup was not fake. Because I heard a lot of uh, pro-Russian channels saying the coup was fake, and even some uh, pro-Ukrainian channels are just non-biased channels. Uh, saying the coup was fake and because that just doesn't happen a coup that just doesn't stall and just ends in like 24 hours however if this is true this probably means a coup was real and Putin basically had the final word in it so again this is all specul this isn't speculation this is an image of the crash plane right now however we're not just going to see a Pogosian just laying about the wreckage Obviously, with a plane crash, just the people aren't really intact, and yeah, so we're probably going to need to wait days, maybe even weeks, and at the longest I could see months to actually get some confirmation. And this comes after a video by Prigozhin of him claiming, I believe, he was in Africa. So again, this is not what's going on. This isn't a war update about Ukraine. However, it could be, again, we we will talk about the consequences of this, if this is true, in another video. However, this is the fog of, like, what just happened. There's a lot of info going. I just found out about this, like, around 17 minutes ago. Uh, one of the news uh, channels that I watch is very unbiased, uh, posted about it on a community post. I just found out about it. So, a lot of information being spread. You're going to catch some that's not true. You're going to catch some that is true. So nothing's confirmed at this moment except for the fact that according to images, of course, images could be images from five years ago of a plane crash. This is the image of the plane crash and there's video footage right here. So nothing's confirmed at the moment. However, Wikipedia has updated his page to dead uh, this day. However, it is under uh, unconfirmed. So again, I do not support, for YouTube, I do not support any assassinations of anybody. This is just, I don't support this. I'm literally just simply reporting on what happened. And if this happens, happened, it's an unfortunate day for Wagner. And just, yeah, I don't really have any words to say. And I don't want to say some stuff that will make me seem like uh, that can get this video taken down because I want you guys to see it. Anyway, guys, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below and tell me what you think about this. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. Once again, YouTube, I do not condone any of this. I'm simply reporting. Bye.